welcome and thank you for joining us for today's encouragement from Our Daily Bread on the 19th of January 2024. The Bible reading today is Matthew chapter 7 verses 13 to 23. Enter through the narrow gate. For wide is the gate and broad is the road that leads to destruction and many enter through it. But small is the gate and narrow the road that leads to life and only a few find it. Watch out for false prophets. They come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they are ferocious wolves. By their fruit, you will recognise them. Do people pick grapes from thorn bushes or figs from thistles? Likewise, every good tree bears good fruit, but a bad tree bears bad fruit. A good fruit tree cannot bear bad fruit, and a bad tree cannot bear good fruit. Every tree that does not bear good fruit is cut down and thrown into the fire. Thus, by their fruit, you will recognise them. Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven but only the one who does the will of my Father who is in heaven. Many will say to me on that day, Lord, Lord, did we not prophesy in your name, and in your name drive out demons, and in your name perform many miracles? Then I will tell them plainly, I never knew you. Away from me, you evildoers. Today's article, titled God's Protective Love, was written by Patricia Raybon. One summer night, the birds near our home suddenly erupted into chaotic cawing. The squawking intensified as the songbirds sent piercing calls from the trees. We finally realised why. As the sun set, a large hawk swooped from a treetop sending the birds scattering into a screeching frenzy, sounding the alarm as they flew from danger. In our lives, spiritual warnings can be heard throughout scripture. Cautions against false teachings, for example. We may doubt that's what we're hearing. Because of his love for us, however, our Heavenly Father provides the clarity of scripture to make such spiritual dangers plain to us. Jesus taught, watch out for false prophets. They come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they are ferocious wolves. He continued, by their fruit you will recognise them. Every good tree bears good fruit, but a bad tree bears bad fruit. Then he warned us, by their fruit, you will recognise them. The prudent see danger and take refuge. Proverbs chapter 22, verse 3 reminds us, but the simple keep going and pay the penalty. Embedded in such warnings is God's protective love revealed in his words to us. As the birds warned each other of physical danger, may we heed the Bible's warnings to fly from spiritual danger and into God's arms of refuge. Let's pray. The scriptures warn with love, dear God, and we thank you. May we heed those words today. Amen. Thanks for listening today. My name's Rebecca and today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.